Ciao. The Viper, even though the Magnus were on over nerf, do you enjoy the game more with the changes or preferred before? I enjoyed more with the changes. For sure, there's more units and activity on the map compared to before. So I, I still prefer it over the over nerf of the Magnus. I think they should just go back halfway towards what the Magnus used to be. Okay, man, my Norton program is going ham. It's spamming me with like stuff being blocked non stop. Go away, I don't care. Stop. It's blocking my minimap. I know you guys can't see it, but it's annoying. I think it's gone now. You hate this map, Altai? Let's see if it's easy. English. Shocker. Um, I can understand why you don't like it. I think it's a it's not right map. Out attacking. Wish. What a greatest map for me here. You hate closed maps. I can't blame you for that either. And there's been a lot of those in AOE 4. Probably left quite a mark on most of us. Arena and Nomad in every 4 I'm not sure if I agree with Arena. I don't think that's that would be that fun in every 4 um, Nomad. Also a thing where it feels like Mongols possibly are just going to be too broken. I don't know. But, but it sounds like... Potentially. I think I'm just gonna go for a fast castle. Don't like any of those positions for the village. Dealing with six vills. But I'd like to do the Imperial Academy. I think Barbican is kind of necessary for safety reasons. Yeah. 
Easy wall, actually. Let's do that. On stone as well. Is that for a town center? Is that for outpost? As he's pushing me. I don't know. I feel like he might want to do a man arms longbow and then tower push with arrows. Oh, yeah, there's already a tower going up there. So I think that's confirmed for sure. But I don't care. I can just go to this wood line. I don't want to tower up here though. This is fine. Well, that's actually open. Ooh. So he doesn't know. <laughs> Yeah, we have spears and longbow. You're chopping. No, oh, don't do that. I feel like that should not be working. Not a nice gameplay mechanic. Yeah, blacksmith as well. Still sending units forward. He's chopping through the middle? Are you kidding me? <sighs> That's so lame. <laughs> Funny. Legit chopping straight through a forest. Crazy. Plus two armor as well. Oh, I oh, really doesn't want us to enter. Too bad I'm already inside. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
I'm gonna go second TC now. Try that. I'm adding a ram. Uh, not ram. Siege engineering. Try to make a ram. If I'm trading well here, it doesn't feel like it's worth it. Fight under the TC. He doesn't have too much food though. Actually, it's the deer. Yeah, never mind. Far. It's gonna backfire for him. He's walling that now, but that's fine. Maybe I mix in one nest of bees. That could be worth it. Or maybe make a second ram. Take the ram. Oh, he's doing white tower. Well, there's my moment to strike. Building it with every villager he has. I think it will go up. Not sure though. <laughs> I think it went up. But at what cost? I really wonder how his eco is now compared to mine. Still losing bills. Oh, okay. There's YOLO fast castle. Get plus two armor on the palace guards. That's actually a quite nice approach. Against someone who tries to do some feudal age stuff. Because if you get plus two armor units into the enemy base, it idles everything. I mean, like right now, at the end of this, let's see a timeline village account. At the end of this, we have two more. Uh, we have more bills than him, even though he's been on two TC for a while. And. I put Vils now on stone, because I thought he might be able to hold. Where's my nest to be? Oh, it's on the way. I thought he might be able to hold, in which case I wanted to make my a second TC and transition to a longer game. So yes, uh, actually, woodline is quite really bad for him, actually. This is the second woodline. Main one. I mean, the main one is okay. It's close to the TC, but it's forward. 
My wood wasn't great either, but... So he was actually trying to chop through, just chop through the trees here so he could run into my base. Why go through all that trouble instead of just like chopping here if you're going to use the chopping trick anyway? <laughs> um, yeah, we found so many sheep as well. It was enough food to spam. I don't know how many men are, mm, palace guards we made. We made a lot. Economy. 2k more food actually in the end. Sick. Also 1k more gold. It's actually pretty insane. 8 minute H3. You can push that one real, like you can go up, be up to castle H around 7 minutes. But then you're not necessarily going to have the defense or the tools you need to make an army or make something in the, the castle H happen. 